What is up, everybody? This is the Wax Man coming to you live from Orlando, Florida, in the Wax Cave. It's been a little bit since I've done a video. Uh, you know, you guys were talking about my allergies, and they uh, got pretty bad. I've been uh, pretty sick with them, and uh, didn't even realize a week has passed. But good news is I've got a Fairfield that I've had tucked away. We've been talking about looking at. Look at this. We got a trammel. Mojo. Let's hope this thing is not damaged. That'd be great because that's a major hit all by itself. So, without further ado, right? We'll talk as we look. It's a pretty tough uh, season we're having in life, aren't we, guys? This is the 23rd of December from 2019. So, this isn't too bad. Oh, Sherman. Sorry about that, buddy. There we go. Let's see what we got here. Yeah. I, you know, we, we really want to thank everybody who's been a subscriber. We really appreciate you guys. Um, I hope things are going well. Uh, we've lost a few family members up in uh, New York. And I'm sure some of you uh, know some or maybe have lost some. And our hearts go out to you too. So please, um, let's just follow what they're asking us to do. I mean, even us for on religious side, we... We started uh, going online uh, and doing our services so that we could protect the congregation. That's part of what it means to love your neighbor, to protect the congregation. And here is a 1990 Diamonds King. We'll throw that up in the stack. And this was stuck to it. This is kind of cool. This is a 1982, look at this, 1983 Flair from its early years. We might have we might have a few of these in here, some of the older cards, and we're going to set that here because that's kind of cool. See how many of those we get, but this is the bad boy. This is the one. Look at that. So it looks like it probably would get a nine, maybe. It's an awesome shape. Uh, obviously, that my LCS doesn't have eh, isn't open, so I can't get no sleeves. So here we go. Let's see if we can't. Uh, no matter what we get out of here at this point, it's a bonus just because we have the Trammel card, the Taylor Trammel rookie card. And oh, this is cool. This is one of those Showdown 2003 sports card games, MLB, Gary Matthews Jr. That's kind of cool. I'll throw that up there for the oddity of it. No, if you really take the time to look at stuff. Well, there's Will Clark, 10th anniversary. You take a look, really look at these cards, the different cards that we find over the years in all these different uh, boxes. Oh, look at this. A Future Stars. Rafael Palmero. There's a lot of different designs, and they really did have some unique ones. There's always some we like, some we don't like. But I think overall, if you took them in a whole, it really helps to watch the evolution, not just of the game, but evolution of what's the most important things to a lot of different people. So I like this set a lot. There's John Buck. It's a catcher for the uh, Blue Jays. There's a real nice card. Just, you know, the look of it. And here's some more Blue Jays. So it looks like we got some Blue Jays in this pack. Oh, yeah, this is a Blue Jays box. So let's see. Batista. Alex Gonzalez. And let's see here. This is Bush. Which Bush is this? Homer Bush. Hmm. His draft pick card there. That's kind of cool. Oh, not his draft pick. Uh, Third year card. Kind of cool. So here's Benito Santiago. Second year card. Steinbeck. There is Billy Ripken. Huh. Look, he's got a number three on the end of this bat that's kind of neat we'll throw that up there <laughs> didn't expect to see that in here oh we got some newer cards too that's good 
Let's see Tyler Flowers, Ordiza, Spangberg, Phillips, and Ron Healy. Not bad, 2018-2019. Let's see what we got in this section. There's Glenn Braggs, Doc Gooden. Look at that. It's kind of a nice card there, the franchise. This is going to come from the uh, 1991. So there's a lot of different interesting cards in here. Let's see Len Harris, Mike Mimes, Bob Melvin. 1982. See, these are nice cards. I'm going to throw this up here too because it's just the neat to get those cards and in the shape that it's in. Slick McFarlane. I don't even know how to say his name. Some interesting names in these cards. So whatever you guys are going through, um, yeah, we all know this is temporary. Things will come to a new normalcy after everything. Once they find uh, something to assist everybody so that they can stay healthy. Because uh, it's not just hitting the older folks. It's it's tearing apart. See, look at this. I told you. Look at this. Look at this. All those nice cards. Look at that. Oh, and a Jim Palmer. We actually have his rookie card. One of those cards that was just beat up and I was able to get. Worth nothing, but it was just really cool to get. Look, and here's some more 82s. Look at that. Look at this. An actual Opeachy 1984 George Fravor. Now with Indians. Grissom. John Crook. And Squeeze Play. Years of diligence and self-denial. All right. This is something definitely different. These are the 80s, 89s, okay. I couldn't remember what year those were. Let's see. There's Albert Bell. Cool. A 96 All-Star card. I don't know. This one was dinged a little bit. That's fine. I don't have... Oh. <laughs> There's so many cards on that one side. I guess that was bound to happen, right, guys? There's an 83 Wally Backman. That's nice. Freddy. All right, let's go with this last section, guys. Like I said, anything else in here is a bonus. These are just bonuses. That's just the beautiful card all by itself. Look at that. A Bo Jackson highlights four consecutive home runs. Let's see. Fire Leaf. Have a nice Andy Van Slyke there. Reynolds, short, best, St. Clair. Yeah, so some of you guys don't like these two sets here. You know, I get it. I get it, but I don't know. I just kind of, I kind of like them. Again, it's just, it's the evolution of Bobby Bonilla. It's the evolution of the, of the, of the cards. Chili Davis wasn't bad. Here's Michael Felder, his rookie. And Steve Saxon. Not too worried about not getting an auto this time because I had so many in a row. Um, yeah, but there's a lot of neat cards, I think so. There's the 85. Man, 85, I was in a 11th grade. No. Yes, I was in 11th grade, and then uh, that was in the spring, and then uh, I started my senior year in 85 in the fall. So this is kind of cool, guys. So again, you know, we just got a lot of different cards that um, really don't see too many of in these Fairfields. Sometimes you see the show one, but these are kind of I like the I like the fact that we can pull out the Bonilla. You know, it's this uh, I can't remember if it's fourth yes fourth year card. You know, we got the Bonilla Jackson uh, eighty two Fleer eighty two eighty is it eighty two Fleers eighty threes sorry 
1983 Fleer's, that's the third year Fleer was out. Some 82s, Jim Palmer was a really good pitcher back in his day. Bob Boone, Doc Gooden, Billy Ripken. He's got the number three on this one. Palmero, Clark, MLB Showdown of Gary Matthews Jr. and Jerry Royster. So I'll throw these up here. But guys, like I said, this is really was well worth it. Well worth it. Actually, some really good shape. Not sure. Maybe there might be a little, a little rough this corner, but that's it. I mean, oh, this thing is in just really nice shape. Beautiful card. So these are these are those, and got some mail that came in. I don't know if I have any other mail coming. Uh, this first package is from Anthony Hockey. I, I that's I think some of the last stuff I ever I got from him. Oh, it's starting to rip open here. Hmm. Okay. So here are my last two things. And what's this? Oh, oh, oh that is so cool. Look at that, guys. I don't even remember, remember if that was coming or not. I mean, I don't even remember it. It's been a while. It's been a minute. That is so cool. That is so cool. Gonna have to take him out of his wrapper later. Let's see what we got here, guys. So we got some cards. Let's do this one first. So I probably use a lot of Steelers. I'm pretty sure that's what I'm gonna be looking at in here. I think there might be a couple other different cards, but uh let's see. So here's his 2018 Mason Rudolph rookie card, showing him with the Hurricanes and, of course, with the Steelers. Another rookie card, Mason Rudolph. Buffalo Bills, Rookies and Stars. So this is this is another. These are some more uh, cards I wanted to get, and really, uh, you know, Josh Allen's a very phenomenal player. Um, I think that he's going to go very far in the league. Here's Josh Allen. So I got a couple of his uh, rookie cards. I was real excited to get those. Here's a Mason Rudolph rookie. James Conner rookie. Jerome Bettis, all-time gridiron. Juju Schuster, Smith Schuster. And this is 2018. And then Richard Mendenhall, 2008 rookie card. I was so grateful to get this. And, and like you said, there was a crease in it. But I, I just wanted to get it for the PC so because I, I didn't have it. And so here's some more rookies and other cards. Let me see. I don't remember everything that's in here. So here we go. So here's a, another Mason Rudolph rookie. And then here's another card. This one was a beat up too. But this was, you know, this is a Topps original from 2000 when they when they started do, redoing this, you know, the buybacks. And um, you know, it was tore up, but still cool to get this card. It's in 1959. And it's buyback cards. Orlando Pena. That's kind of neat. Here's another Josh Allen rookie. And here we go. So here's Lamar Jackson and Hayden Hurst. Round one numbers. 32nd overall. This is 2018. So I was excited to get that. Uh, then we've got a Terry Bradshaw Reflections, which is, you know, the showing of Bradshaw and Ben. That's going to be an iconic card. Uh, Super Bowl stars. Ben Roethlisberger. And then we've got a 
James Washington, rookie. And another Mason Rudolph, rookie rated rookie. I, you know, Rudolph, if everyone remembers, had that incident last year with the Browns. And the interesting thing is, I think that the, the duck, as they call him, Man, my mind is blank right now. I'm in. I'm in. I am still in some pain, guys, with this this infection, and I'm just been kind of feeling bad that I haven't been doing nothing for you guys, or, or sending or posting anything for you guys. So I want to make sure I had something for you tonight. It's, I was looking back, and I couldn't believe I turned to my wife. I was like, "Man, I haven't done a video in a week." Um, Duck Hodges, he's he's going to be phenomenal too. Rudolph, um. I'm not sure how long it's going to take him to recover, but I think he was not fully recovered from the uh, from his uh, concussion when they went into that game. Okay, before you get damaged, buddy, let's put you over there. All right, I think we should be fine now. And um, now this stuff here is coming from Erling Collect Erling Collectibles. He's a really good guy. He's always uh, doing something. And I actually don't remember what I what I got. I told him I saw him in a stream the other day, and I told him that I still had to do the video. But he, but you know his, his name is John and Erling Collectibles. He's been always, always doing something for the community. When I say the community, I'm talking about, you know, not the just the baseball community, but also the uh, uh, donate, you know, like charities and things like that. So uh, once in a while, I I do a little donation to them. Okay, there we go. So it's out. Nothing else is in there. And let's see what we got here. So this is... Oh, excellent. So you had everything listed in here for me. So there were some, some auction cards. And... Um, 2020 Tops Series 1. Okay, so let's... John Smoltz. Oh, look at that. So we got a nice little thing in here. Let's break these out. And this will probably be a little while before I do another video. I just, it's, I don't know, 2 something in the morning. I'm up. I was having trouble sleeping. All right, here we go. So we got to go through these two stacks here. Okay, so we got uh, Jay Bruce. Holiday. Oh, look, at these are Mets. Perfect. Look at that. Look at this. Chromes. Some nice, nice, nice Mets in here, guys. Zach Wheeler. His Bowman card, and this is going to be from 2015. And he'd already played for a couple of years at this point, but it's still kind of cool to get it. Here is Jacob deGrom. This is his first year card. Juan Lagardes. Jason Bay, opening day. Angel Pagan. Jose Reyes. That's kind of cool one right there. 2011. John Nice. This goes back to uh, 2011, also, and that is rookie. But you know he was up and down, up and down. And here's a really nice little uh, Mets 2002 draft pick, David Bacani. And here's Tom Glavin when he was on the Mets. Wow, look at that. That is kind of neat, huh, guys? Who would have thought? Been with the Braves. And now here he is with the Mets. Jose Reyes. This is his. Uh, let's see, 2000. Let's see here. 
second base, 2004. So this is his first year card. And it's the Bazooka card. Look at that. That's cool. There's Leonard Donardo. Oh, look at that. We were talking about these in the earlier, weren't we? See, Dave Kingman, 1983. And then we've got this here, Big Poppy. It's not a patch, but it looks really nice. Somebody, uh, let me set those aside real quick. Because right, I got a, my buddy, John Jonathan Red Sox Reyes. Because, you know, these are going to him, these Red Sox. And then Hunter Strickland's rookie card. I was really excited. That I that nobody wanted it, so I took it. I was like, I'll take that card, man. That's an awesome card to get. And so now these will be. Let's start with these. So these are 2020s, Billy Hamilton. Here's that Chipper Jones. Look at that nice stamp right there. Real excited about that. Love this fact. I could get this one too. This is uh, Ozzy Albies, 2020. So there we go. Let's see, as you can see, I've got, I got the uh, the Braves here. Sirocco. Sirocco's rookie cup card. He uh, his rookie year would be twenty eighteen. Yeah, twenty eighteen was his rookie card, and then twenty nineteen. That's why this would be his cup card. I think last year was a future stars. He didn't play enough to. Or he, he finally played enough to get the rookie cup. Here's what here we go. Dom Dom. How you doing, Dom? So excited about this guy here. And see that? See? Syracuse. You guys got to see a, a real good player when he was down there. And when he was there, he's only batting 222. But he's he's turning out to be a real good uh, player for the Mets. Zach Wheeler, of course, Pete, repeat, right? Zach Wheeler, Ahmed Rosario, Pete Alonzo. This will be the 2020. Turkey Red Cards, Jake DeGrom, Jeff McNeil, Future Stars, and JT Vrelmuto. So Philadelphia, it looks like these are the cards coming now. And, and look, at this. this is this is a really nice Harper card. Look at that. Got the team card. Let's see, Birdie Blake Parker. Sorry, <laughs> Scott Kingery, another up and coming future star of the game. Another future star right here, and Reese Hoskins, Trey Turner. Oh yeah, these are the Nationals. I got was another team. And man, it's just a nice Juan Soto. That's a parallel card there. Let's see the border. Sean Doolittle, Rendon, and Sanchez. All these are sleeved. And then this. I'm going to put it back here in a second. That is just, just a beautiful, beautiful medallion. Commemorative medallion of John Smoltz's rookie year. You know, sometimes when you get stuff like this, guys, I know they're not, that they're junk. But you know what? This we were talking about earlier when we were going through the Fairfields. When we really, really take the time to really see what these cards are looking like, and you really look at the history of them, it is kind of neat. Because, you know, it is a part of history when we see stuff. That's cool, though. That's a cool schmaltz. All right, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, we're about 24 minutes right now. I really appreciate every one of you. Uh, I've been talking to some of you guys, uh, whether it's through text, uh, through the streams. Um, you know, you never wish bad things on people, honestly. When you do, it's you just have to expect that that bad stuff can come back on you. So whenever I'm not feeling well, um, I just hope none of you guys have to go through any of the, the pains, the aches, the the allergies, the, the any of the things, the, the health issues, 
And I feel for you guys, and I hope you guys are okay. And I hope you guys can stand up and, and grin and bear it. Why? Because, man, you treat, treat each other respect and dignity. This community went through a, a tough time, and I'm and I'm, I believe it's mostly over. I haven't seen anything too bad lately. Um, you know, some people they they still have their comments. I have my my feelings on some of the people in the community, but at the same time, um, I try to still watch their content because they they they're putting out good content. Um, they're trying to um, show their joy for this art just like we are i'm just gonna pull him out here that's just a beautiful card guys <clears throat> see e even though i've been on I i'm just look at that p alonzo rookie that's just beautiful huh <clears throat> so guys um again i appreciate every one of you that's been watching my uh, videos giving me the thumbs up i really appreciate that too um I enjoy doing this for you guys. I'm not sure when I'll do another video. Maybe in a few days uh, when I feel a little better. Or I can't ha I can't sleep again. Enjoy, guys. It's just like I enjoy watching your videos, talking to you guys. And you know I just pop in for a few minutes here and there at this point, even though I have a lot of time on my hands. But you can hear it in my voice. The allergies are, are severe. Uh, they've knocked me down for about a month now. I've been working through it. I did a lot of videos through them and um, a lot of medication. I've got, good God, got, I think I picked three or four more bottles of medication tomorrow. I've got seven I picked up two days ago. So it's just part of life sometimes, guys. And I don't say this for you to feel bad for me, but to let you know that, hey, I'm here. Um, I see you guys and, and, and I want so much to, to do the trades we're talking about. Um, but if you give me some time and some patience on your part, I'll, t I'll take care of you guys right. Thank you guys again so much. Wax is out.